Hi, thanks for tuning in to this video. This is recorded as a podcast, so it's audio only. If you'd like to just listen to it, there's links in the description below to find it on Spotify and all the other podcast platforms. Thank you for joining in. Welcome to The Culture Attic, the place where we talk and think about popular culture. I'm your host, Granby. Let's get right into the episode today. Welcome back. I'm Scramby to the Culture Attic. That was a weird intro, but who cares? Keep rolling. So you've seen the title and you've seen these ads. All you have to do is connect forward to get paid a thousand bucks. Oh, you don't have any money on you? Just play this game for 10 seconds. You can pay for your takeout, whatever. Spin a wheel, make a lot of money apps. And everybody knows that's fake, right? But still, you're curious. You're like, hold up. I see this all the time. And obviously, it's fake, but how does it work? You know, they got these people that react to winning money, but there are always just people that like have just found out they're going to the best college or got a good grade or, you know, somebody came home from being deployed at war or whatever. They steal reactions and they turn it into people winning a lot of money. And then these apps, they promote amazing profits and a lot of money. But how fake is it actually? We know it's not real, but how fake is it? That's what I wanted to check out. So I was like, fuck it. I'm downloading one of these apps. I want to be rich and I want to play games. This seems like my dream job. So I figured, and you know, I did some investigation. I downloaded some apps and I can tell you with 100% honesty, I'm fucking rich, broke boys. I made 700, 350, and then another 1,245 and 12 cents. By spinning a wheel. Yeah. Thought you didn't believe that, huh? But in all honesty, it's fake. And I told you that, and you know that. But how fake is it? Well, the reviews are fake. That's the one thing. I already established that the reactions are fake. But the reviews, they see how they have like a pretty high average review rating because they're just botted reviews. And then all the recent ones are like one star, one star, one star. Because what are these apps doing? Well, most of them is you win some money, right? On the house, you get like some credits and you can, okay. But then you think, oh, you can actually win. And then you play and you have to put money in to keep playing. And then you never hit the level you need to hit in order to pay out. It's that simple. You know, you need to have a minimum of 10 bucks to pay out and you always stick at nine, nine eighty, and you never get there. And you pay like, what, two euros to, to start? So, you know, you lose your money, they make some money, and you're just pissed. That's how it works. So basically, you put in money, and you can't get any returns. And you got your two, you got, they got your true bucks, you can't do anything. Is this illegal? I don't know, it seems false advertising, but who's going to crack down on ads in, like, shitty games? Nobody. Because nobody really cares. So, I know you knew deep down it wasn't true, but just to, just to rub it in, don't use these apps. You're going to waste money and you're going to be pissed and you're going to be like, oh, you're going to have a shitty day and you're going to be disappointed. It's not true, guys. That's all I can say. Anyway, thank you for listening to this very short episode. Peace out.